She was supposed to help a man in need, but a local home health aide is accused of taking tens of thousands of dollars and going on a spending spree. And when the victim wasn't getting any money back, he turned to Tappy Phillips and got seven on his side. Tappy? That's right. And the Keyport man suffered from multiple health issues and needed a health aid. His partner hired a woman from a local agency, but when money started disappearing from their account, they realized they had been robbed. And when the bank wouldn't help, they called for seven on their side. It was the ultimate betrayal for me. Steve Cummings is talking about the home health aid he hired for his companion, Jim Gordon. Okay. Jim has multiple health issues, including kidney failure and a weak heart. Last August, they hired a home health aide to help Jim while Steve was at work. We completely trusted her. But one day, Steve opened Jim's bank statement and noticed some strange charges. Things like Jiffy Lube, um, Stop and Shop, um, Kmart, Walmart, and I knew he wasn't shopping at those places. And it got worse trips to Atlantic City and hundreds of dollars withdrawn from ATMs in a single day. The account started out with over $24,000 in it, but after a couple of months... It was now whittled down to $34.10. Emptied out. Emptied out. Steve made a police complaint, and soon the home health aide became a suspect. Police believe she watched as Jim entered his pin at an ATM and then stole his card. Shortly afterwards, she was arrested. You were arrested, no, I Yes, you were. I have an arrest report right here. The health aide, Letitia Rollinson, didn't want to talk to us. She faces theft charges. But Steve and Jim thought the bank should have stopped the withdrawals long before the account was depleted. And the bank never called us. They made not one phone call inquiring about any kind of suspicious activity, which is what you would think a bank would do. Steve reported the fraud to the bank, but they denied his claim. I thought that banks were places where your money is safe, and now I've learned otherwise with that. Then Steve and Jim got seven on their side. We got our money back. The bank, PNC, put the entire amount back in the account. And I have you guys to thank. <laughs> it was our pleasure. Yeah. Congratulations. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Now, the company that hired the home health aide said she passed a criminal background test. The company has now given Jim another aide at no charge. And as for Jim and Steve, they have moved their money to another bank, this time no ATM card. That's just shocking. Yeah, it is. Boggling. Yes, yeah. it is. It really is. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Tab.